The President, please be seated. Le Président. Veuillez vous asseoir. The court is now back in session. Audience est reprise. We continue hearing the testimonies of the civil party this afternoon. Oui, Before we hand civil over to cet après-midi, avant de the lead co-lawyers for the civil parties. La parole au co-avocat principal pour les parties civiles. Could the lawyer be advised or reminded that uh, you speak rather slowly because we have noted that you spoke rather fast? Nous avons que vous It would vite. be important for the record and for the interpreters and leaving some enfin, pause uh, for les interprètes. The question to be put and answer to be made, it would be la et la réponse, et vice versa. precisely clear for interpreters and uh, the recorder to record this. Now, civil parties, you may now proceed. Oui, Monsieur le Président, avant de reprendre le, yes, l'interrogatoire de Monsieur Clanfit, je souhaitais poser une question à la Cour. Uh, like la Chambre, dans son mémo E145, a prévu que, de façon exceptionnelle, les parties pouvaient, par une demande orale, euh, demander à pouvoir interroger une partie ou un témoin au-delà des sujets qui concernent le premier procès witness, et euh, sur des sujets issues, qui concerneraient donc le cas numéro 2 uh, dans son ensemble. Est-ce que segment? pour des raisons d'organisation de, et de bonne administration, two, il serait possible que les parties qui ont l'intention de formuler ce genre de demande le Would formule avant que nous commencions l'interrogatoire pour que nous puissions adapter notre so interrogatoire en fonction de ce que sera l'interrogatoire des so autres parties. Je pense que ce serait utile et que nous avons besoin de ce renseignement. Of the witness accordingly. It would be good for you to clarify this issue on before on proceed. Thank you. The President, the, President, the Chamber has the already President. informed the party already with reference to, to the memorandum I referred to by you just now. And on Monday, the Chamber also advised uh, the parties with regard to the examination Lundi, of the accused and witnesses and the civil parties témoins et parties civiles. during trials. The first segment of the trial, the case which is now called K001, rather K002 slash 001, and the examination shall be taking place one segment at a time. And We are now focusing on the issues relevant to the paragraphs that have already been read out by the Greffiers concerning the structure of the democratic Cambodia and uh, the historical background of each and individual accused. During this examination of civil party, parties are advised to limit their questions to only matters relating to this first segment, the first phase and second phase of the evacuation. I, uh, we hope that the parties have already been informed since uh, Documents have already been communicated Des to ont déjà été them. Communiqués aux à ce sujet. Simplement pour être certaine, donc si une partie 
euh, à l'intention de demander de façon exceptionnelle de poser des questions sur d'autres sujets, la Chambre refusera en ce qui concerne M. Clamfit. Uh, Est-ce que je crois savoir qu'une au moins une partie souhaite poser des questions uh, au-delà uh, du sujet qui nous occupe uh, aujourd'hui et je voudrais être certaine uh, que la Chambre ne n'autorisera pas ou autorisera And le cas échéant, like mais que nous sachions avant de poursuivre notre interrogatoire ce qu'il en est exactement. Pardon d'assister. Merci. The president. Le président. We believe that the uh, through our memorandum, the parties have been informed already concerning these uh, procedures. In particular, if parties wish to put questions to an expert si or witness or civil party, which is departing from the facts as indicated in the memorandum. Hors du champ couvert par les faits prévus par le memorandum. Such departure from uh, that uh, topic uh, will be most likely rejected uh, by Cela the chamber. Pro fort probablement rejeté par la chambre. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président. Mesdames et Messieurs les Juges, Good afternoon. Uh, à ce propos, je voudrais simplement uh, demander à la chambre d'éclairer les parties sur ce qu'elle entend par motif exceptionnel qui pourrait justifier que l'on aille au-delà des questions qui sont relatives à la première partie du procès. Que ce soit aujourd'hui ou plus tard, ça nous intéresserait de savoir ce qu'on peut entendre par motif exceptionnel de manière à préparer adéquatement les questions pour les différents témoins et parties civiles. Je vous remercie for witnesses and several parties. Thank you. Uh, may I be heard, Mr. President, because I believe the questions that have been asked this afternoon have already been answered at the informal trial management meeting. There's no reason to waste time in this court on these matters. If someone wishes to go beyond the scope, certainly they can seek leave. That leave should be done well in advance so nobody is ambushed. And that would give you honors an opportunity to decide whether to grant that leave or not. But the second question was particularly answered a couple of times, though those who have posed the questions, regrettably, were not at the informal Trial management qui ont posé la question lors des we'll réunions happy informelles. To, to provide them with the minutes that we took of those meetings de faire part du procès verbal que nous avons pris et les notes que nous avions prises lors de ces réunions. Et ces questions Thank ont you. déjà fait l'objet de discussions et ont déjà obtenu réponse. The president. Le président. Thank you, counsel, Merci, for this. Uh, we hope that uh, parties have been fully aware of this, but the Chamber Nous wishes to clarify again that de la à suivre. we would like uh, to refer to the 
combined facts nous rappelons as uh, listed in the document for our first uh, segment of the trial document prévu one par le two document four slash e seven bar slash twenty four correction quatre two correction two parties who wish to go beyond the scope as indicated in this document has to sujet, really request their leave in advance with reasons for such request for leave to go ce, beyond the avance. scope. And as a counsel for Ying Thiri already indicated, Comme there had been several meetings and discussions rappelé, before, before we came sujet. to today's sessions with reference to the severance of the trial, for example, by way of sever them into segments of the division trials, du procès so that we can speed up the proceedings. Phases. We believe that uh, enfin, this document is significant enough for Nous parties que to le be document is sufficient for the parties to be bien informed. Et merci, Monsieur le Président, pour ces précisions. Euh, J'ai lu attentivement, bien sûr, le mémorandum. Simplement, j'en déduis par conséquent de vos observations à l'instant qu'aucune des parties ici n'a l'intention de demander de façon exceptionnelle qu'il soit possible d'interroger Planfit sur d'autres sujets puisque personne ne l'a fait suffisamment à l'avance. Donc je pense que nous pouvons considérer qu'il n'y aura pas de questions au-delà du premier petit procès. J'espère que j'ai compris correctement ce qui m'a été indiqué sur le fait de demander suffisamment à l'avance. Mais je voulais que ce soit clair, puisque notre questionnement est évidemment dépendant de ce qui pourrait suivre ensuite. Merci. May parties be reminded that before the examination on the Monday morning, the chamber already in party. reminded the parties and that we try to avoid any que, que disruption of the uh, court proceeding and uh, we already made it clear uh, now counsel for civil party, you may now proceed. Le plus de retard possible. La parole est Moïse Vannery, thank you, Mr. President. Des parties civiles. Morceau Vannery. Merci. Monsieur le Président. Just for the record, this is further to the comments of Judge Lever in earlier today. Um, I would like to read this into the record because it may be necessary to make submissions on it at a later date. Uh, I'm just reading from Cambodian Code of Criminal Procedures, Section 3, Conduct of Trial Hearings. This is Article 3.12. A civil party may never be heard as a witness. I'm not sure my Cambodian colleagues will be able to expand on that a bit. Thank you. Merci. The President, Judge Laverne, you may proceed. Monsieur le Juge Laverne, vous avez la parole. Si, si je comprends bien ce, la, ref, la remarque qui vient d'être faite par euh, la défense de Nunchia, s'interroge sur le sens Nunchia. de l'article 300. He is, he is talking about je ne sais plus quel article. est le numéro de l'article. I don't remember which uh, article you are referring to. 312 du Code de procédure pénale cambodgien. 312 du Cambodian Penal Code. Aucune que la partie civile ne peut jamais être entendue en qualité de témoin. C'est cela Vous interrogez sur le sens de cette disposition. Alors, cette disposition... 
similaire c'est en droit français ou en droit cambodgien signifie simplement que une partie civile ne, porte, ne prête pas le serment des témoins. Et bien évidemment, si une partie civile doit porter son témoignage sur des faits, elle est entendue. Mais elle a entendu en qualité de partie civile, pas en tant que témoin prétendant serment. Thank you, Your Honor. It was just so that we could refer to it down the line when it comes time to make legal submissions. The President, uh, Council Motsawanri, you may now proceed. Council Motsawanri, thank Maître you, Motsawanri. Mr. President, again. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Uncle Klangfit, uh, this morning we left off with uh, your testimony when you said you helped build the house for Ying Sari and that you met uh, Paul Pot and Yang Sari in person. My follow-up question would be, when did you meet them? Ma question est la suivante. Quand les avez-vous rencontrés? Clan Fit. Réponse. I don't remember the year. It, it was before 1970. Je ne me souviens pas de l'année, mais c'était avant 1970. Question. Question. When you met uh, them, what did they tell you to do? Quand vous les avez rencontrés, que vous ont-ils demandé de faire? I was not told Réponse. anything other than to protect them from enemies. De les protéger because contre there les were ennemis. police commune chiefs y avait des and other people des in Palau where personnes à Palau, uh, the enemies could be close to them. Qui pouvaient être proches des ennemis. Question. Thank you. Question. Can you tell us what role did you Told that uh, you were tasked with uh, building the house and were allowed to enter that house. Le rôle que vous aviez dans le la construction de la maison et si I vous aviez was le droit appointed entrer, as the commune chef. J'ai été nommé chef de commune. Question. Could you also Question. tell us uh, what Commune were, vous nous dire were you the commune chief of? De quelle commune il s'agissait? Response: Talao commune. La commune de Bokau district. District de Bokau. Uh, in the Andong Mias region. Dans la région de Andong Mias. Question: Thank you. Can you please tell the Question. court uh, as a commune chief of Talao? Pouvez-vous expliquer à la cour How many communes was you in charge uh, du to administer and how many households ou plutôt de, de domicile Response. de foyer ou Six de ville gérer I don't remember how many households I can recollect Il y avait six villages je ne me souviens plus du nombre de foyers Question Can you also Question. tell the court again as a commune chief, what tasks aussi nous dire did you have, do, did you have to perform? Titre de chef de commune. Response, I was the Réponse. chief of education responsable in villages. De and dans les villages. secondly, I was tasked with protecting une autre de mes, our une autre de mes location from the Vietnamese, de not allowing the Vietnamese to come in. De, contre des invasions vietnamiennes. Question. You Question. said uh, you had to protect the area 
and not allow the Vietnamese Vous dites coming que vous in. Protéger Can you tell la the court the entrer? situation of the Khmer Rouge policy why yeah. Vietnamese were banned from coming la into the location? Response, because uh, we were asked uh, to be very uh, cautious and not to really break uh, de faire confidentiality. Mr. President, I'm going to object. La if you go back and listen to the Maître question, Carnavas. it assumes si a fact, not an evidence. Vous écoutez la she question, injects the word policy elle against elle the elle Vietnamese. Met des mots de Where on earth has he testified about that in advance? Quand she déjà feeds him the answer and then he basically says yes. Et lui, ensuite, it's classic répond, oui. uh, leading the une witness. Question now, if they're going to be in charge of taking the witness first, si. Then I would les parties civiles, les avocats des parties civiles vont euh, asked, avoir la responsabilité de leur interrogatoire, du premier interrogatoire des parties. Il faut qu'ils leur posent des questions sur le qui, comment, où, pourquoi, et de demander aux au témoins d'expliquer et de ne pas simplement That's donner aux témoins des faits qu'ils viendront ensuite valider. Cela n'est pas approprié. Much so wonderly, if the president allows, I would like to respond to this si question. Si le président me le permet, j'aimerais répondre à la question. Uh, uh, this uh, assertion. When I put question with regard to the policy concerning the Vietnamese, posé cette this sur piece la of information is relating to the historical background of the. Historique. Khmer Rouge regime and, the, and Vietnam and du civil party Rouge already indicated earlier Vietnam, on le, that la he was tasked with protecting the location from the enemies and the Vietnamese. So I would Vietnamiens. like uh, to know more why he was asked to do that and I believe that such a question was not cela. a leading Je question que and civil parties already told the court about the Vietnamese in this court earlier on. The President, uh, International Co Prosecutor, you may now proceed. Je vous remercie, Monsieur le Président. Euh, je Thank voudrais you, simplement Mr. signaler Let que cette question des questions tendancieuses, comme ça a été traduit en français, donc des leading questions, leading a été posée vendredi dernier, précisément par M. Carnavas, à la personne de la Senior Legal Officer. Carnavas. Et il lui a été répondu que ces questions tendancieuses, leading questions, étaient autorisées. Alors, je ne sais pas si il faudra donner à M. Carnavas le compte rendu de la réunion, mais je pense que ça a été posé par lui-même et que ça a été répondu. Minutes of that meeting, but uh, he himself put that question to the senior legal officer, and uh, she did respond to it. The gentleman is referring to the earlier of questions that they were raising, and so if they're going to be quoting from that, they should at least si put it into context. Cela, it has nothing to do with what is happening here today with the lawyer for the civil parties asking leading questions. She's used the word policy. Elle a utilisé le terme policy politique. has a particular meaning. Le terme the gentleman never said anything about a policy. Sens particulier. Now she can le ask him what he was asked to do, why he was asked to do it, when, ce a fait, how, and so on. But the moment that she begins to characterize, in the manner in which he did, comme elle fait, that's testifying from the witness, from uh, as a lawyer, and that's what is called leading. Comme avocat, et c'est ce que j'appelle une question Thank you. tendancieuse. Merci. Now, some no the president, what? may we Le président. having noted that the questions are put uh, by the council for the Notant civil party que les are based uh, on the facts 
par l'avocat des parties civiles uh, sur des faits charges, so, uh, she déjà is now rapportés au juge d'instruction, elle peut Mike poursuivre. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Next question. As the commune chief at Talao commune, who en tant que appointed chef you de la commune to that position? Talao, qui vous a nommé? Response. Om, Réponse. Om Wang, Om, Om Ya, Wang, ya and Om Tong Si. Et Tong Si. Ta luk Om Ai. Question. Question. Could you tell the court what roles they held uh, during those days? The court, three people you mentioned. Les rôles de ces trois personnes. Response. Om Tong Si was the Om chief Tongsi of the district. Était chef de district. While the other people were the zone committee. Les deux autres faisaient partie du comité de zone. Question. Now I would Question. like to ask you concerning the period when the Khmer Rouge liberated Phnom uh, Penh de la période on April 17th of 1975. Could you tell us how you learned of this information quand, that the Khmer Rouge liberated Phnom Penh? Réponse. We heard that uh, there was a coup d'état by Lonel Khmer attacked Khmer. Lonel avait fait un coup d'état et que des Khmer attaquaient des Khmer. Question. When Phnom Penh Question. was taken over by the Khmer Rouge in 1975, Donc, the 17th of April, where quand, were you? Où étiez-vous le 17 avril 1975 quand les Khmer Rouge ont pris le contrôle Response, de Phnom Penh? Response: I was in the same village. Réponse: J'étais dans le même village. Monsieur le Président. Mr. President, si vous permettez que je prenne la parole, je vous prie de m'excuser, cher consoeur, mais vous venez d'indiquer, Monsieur le Président, que l'ordonnance de clôture établissait des faits. Et je dois dire que je suis un petit peu inquiet de cette conception de l'ordonnance de clôture, parce que si l'ordonnance de clôture établit des faits, alors je me demande pourquoi est-ce que nous sommes ici pour organiser ce procès, why we are here today. le procès, à mon sens, que a trial. qui se tient aujourd'hui n'est pas une relecture de l'ordonnance de clôture. It's not a re et effectivement, comme le dit justement order. And indeed, mon confrère my Michael Carnavas, <coughs> le fait de savoir s'il y a eu des politiques et si elles ont été mises en œuvre, et comment euh, fait partie des interrogations du procès qui s'annonce. Mais si votre chambre considère dès aujourd'hui que l'ordonnance de clôture établit ce fait, alors nous pouvons nous arrêter dès maintenant. Donc, euh, je ne sais pas si la traduction qui a été donnée de votre réponse correspondait avec ce que vous avez voulu Answer. Il me paraît que Tell est capitale you pour la suite say. des débats. C'est la remarque que je voulais faire. Crucial for the way forward in this uh, trial. That is the remark I wanted to make.
Your observation lack of uh, substance. I don't see any specific motion. It was a mere disruption to the proceedings. The chamber has made it clear La chambre the flow of the proceedings, both in written and oral form. Se faire la procédure, par écrit et par oral. And we should not be taken by surprise in relation to the flow of the proceedings without any specific motion. So I would now like to give the floor to the civil party lawyers to continue questioning. Sovanari. Thank you, Mr. President. After the Khmer Rouge liberated Phnom Penh, in April 1975, were you invited to come to Phnom Penh uh, to take the political training courses in Phnom Penh? Answer, yes, I came to Phnom Penh. I came twice. And Mr. Nguyen Chia was the lecturer or trainer at that time. Question. Thank you. You said you were invited to come to Phnom Penh to attend political training course uh, twice, and it was the trainer was Nguyen Chia. So when did you come? Uh, when did you first come to Phnom Penh? I uh, make an objection or raise an objection before the... So the party answers I think we're leaving the scope of the first trial segment. This is unrelated to the evacuation of Phnom Penh. This is unrelated to the second phase of the transfer of the people. So I would like to object to this question. Ni en rapport avec le deuxième déplacement forcé de population. Donc j'objecte, objecte à cette question. Chum toa khmien bat sat de phiep. The objection is not sustained. Le président, votre objection est the rejetée. The civil party shall continue to answer this Et question la civile est à à la because question. this question relates Car closely question to the history of the, Democrat, uh, the Communist Party of Cambodia. Sovanri. So in order to assist the civil party, I would like to um, ask the question again. Je repose la question. When you first Lorsque invited to come to Phnom Penh to attend a training course conducted by Nguyen Chia, I would like to know uh, what are the subject matters of the training at that time. À ces uh, séances Response. Réponse. At that time, I think the main substance of the training was that uh, once we liberated our country, uh, we had to uh, work together and we had to uh, build a structure of the country in order to uh, continue to hold the independence of the country. Question. Lawyer. So when you first came to Phnom Penh for the political Penh, training course, who else uh, were invited uh, to attend the classes? The class. Answer. They invited the uh, zone uh, committee to attend this training. Lawyer. How long did the training last? Answer, uh, it lasted for five days. Lawyer, 
You mentioned that uh, you came to Phnom Penh twice for uh, this uh, training, and Nguyen Chia conducted this training. So do you remember uh, what were the main uh, subject of the training? Well, I did not know anything. At that time, I, did not, I was not literate, and I uh, could not read anything. So they invited me to come to Phnom Penh. I just came as, in, in, as in invited. Question. A lawyer. So beside Nguyen Chia, were there any other Autre leaders of the Khmer Rouge who came to conduct Rouge the training for the group? None. Uh, réponse, aucun. Lawyer. When you were attending this political training course, were you given uh, documents or materials uh, for the participants? Answer. Réponse. Yes. Uh, oui. Handouts and material were uh, distributed, but I did not take those documents because I was illiterate. Je, je I could not read anything, so I did not take those materials with me. Question. Question. You said uh, you were given documents, but you uh, did not take those documents. Do you know what that document was all about? Uh, was it a political document uh, indoctrinated by the Khmer Rouge or it was any other types of document? Answer. Well, I thought it was the document or handout relating to the statute of the party because uh, we were told that uh, the revolution uh, would be a long-term uh, program or activities so we had to be familiar uh, with the statute i did not know what party is all about i did not know anything about that but i uh, merely listened to them at that time Question. Question. So you know that that document related to the statute of the party. Uh, did they elaborate on the meaning of the statute? Did they tell you how to get the job done uh, or anything else? Could you elaborate on that? Yes, well, they taught us uh, how to maintain our standpoint. Comment and uh, secondly, they, want, they taught us morality. And thirdly, uh, they, they taught us to be moderate, to be humble. So these are related to the statutes of the party. Because I was illiterate and ignorant, I did not even understand what uh, the statute of the party was all about, but I just learned that, well, it was uh, a long-term uh, activities for us, and uh, secondly, uh, we had to maintain good morale in a society, and thirdly, we had to be humble. Uh, if we uh, are not uh, humble, if we do not uh, abide by these three principles, then uh, we may be you know, uh, killed Nous by the enemies. Question. Question. So when you, uh, when you were invited to Phnom Penh, how did you receive this inv Penh, invitation? Uh, who invited you to Phnom Penh? Phnom Penh? Réponse. A letter was sent uh, through the zone and sector from and sent down from the sector to the uh, sub-district uh, level. So we, uh, I received uh, the letter of invitation to attend the course. Question. Question. You said that you were 
appointed uh, to be the uh, commune chief of the Lao following the liberation of Phnom Penh. So, following the liberation of Phnom Penh in 1975, uh, what what position were you in Quelle in the rank of the uh, Khmer Rouge uh, following the liberation of Phnom Penh? Question, uh, answer. Réponse. In 1976, I was appointed the uh, deputy secretary of a district. The district. You are the deputy Question. chief of the district. What district was that? Du district. De quel district? It was Réponse. called District 21 le in district sector 101. Dans le secteur 101. Question. Question. You say that you were appointed to be the uh, deputy secretary of District 21. Uh, can you District 21. Tell us the structure of the zone that you were in. What were the uh, leader of that uh, zone? De la zone. Answer. Réponse. Wang was the Wang. chief of the uh, committee Était and team was the uh, zone secretary. Était le secrétaire de zone. Question. Question. Uh, f in the northern zone uh, committee, who were le côté de la zone in the management of this committee? Qui était chef? Answer. Réponse. I try to enumerate it. We have Pog, Chia, Nguyen Chia, Ja, We, Kat, Kat. They were in the uh, committee. Ils étaient tous dans le comité. These uh, these were the people whom I I uh, knew, Ça, but there might be other leaders in this uh, zone as well. Question. 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 So in the North East zone, uh, how many districts zone, were there? Nord il y avait de there were three uh, districts. District. district 21, I was district the 21. secretary. Uh, we have Cao and Poi, responsible for Poy the two districts. Des deux autres districts. Just now you mentioned uh, there were three uh, districts, uh, District 21, 22, and 23. And you said that uh, Bu Kao was the secretary of, uh, S, uh, of um, District 22, and uh, Pao was the secretary of District 23. How about District 21? Who was the secretary? Uh, Answer, I am the... Uh, Deputy Secretary, secretary and Tim was the Secretary. He was the Secretary the of the uh, District and district. he was also the um, Chief of the il District as well. Le chef du district. I at that time told them that I did not know anything. I was uh, illiterate. I could not hold this position, but they insisted that I uh, worked as the Deputy Secretary of this District. Question. Question. Just now you said uh, Bu Kao was the secretary Kao of District 22. District so I would like to know uh, what happened to Bu Kao later on, uh, the, the secretary of District 22. Answer. I heard from others and from Tim as well that uh, he, he uh, he uh, contacted with the Vietnamese, uh, that's why uh, he was uh, arrested. He bought uh, for cows, for uh, chickens uh, with the Vietnamese, and then uh, uh, after, after that he was arrested. I'm sorry to interrupt again, but I'm, I'm lost. I, I really don't see the relevance of these issues, these topics, with regard to the first trial section. This has nothing to do with the evacuation of 
the phase two of the transfer of people. This is not relevant for the history of the party or the structure of the party. May the we President Your observation is uh, sustained and I would like to remind the civil party lawyers to uh, refine your question so that uh, they fit into the first uh, segment of the trial. So please uh, try to avoid uh, departing from the uh, segment of trial that we have already designated. Civil Party Lawyer. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. President, for reminding uh, since the uh, Civil Party uh, referred to the structure and I uh, continue to uh, dwell on that issue. Merci, Monsieur le Président. La partie civile a parlé de la structure. Je voudrais donc poursuivre sur ce point. Le Président, je vous en prie. Thank you very much, Mr. President, for reminding. I uh, continue to elicit the answer uh, for this because it relates to the structure of the Communist Party in the northeastern part of the country. And in the case uh, filed, uh, there were also uh, statements by Bukhauf and Poi as well in, in the case file. That's why it was related. And Bukhauf's uh, statement was in document D. And in, uh, and uh, in point document uh, statement was uh, document D one five five slash five four point three. President, well, it is not uh, necessary that this um, document or statements are in the case, uh, case file, but I would like to remind you that the. Uh, uh, the testimony must be related to the first uh, segment of the uh, first trial. It does not mean that uh, as long as it is in the case file, we can raise it, but we have to raise all the points that is uh, relevant to the section in the first uh, phase of trial. So uh, the main uh, subject matter of this uh, segment is the uh, first phase of evacuation of Phnom Penh. Civil party lawyer, thank you, Mr. President. And of course, uh, this first segment involves the structure of the Communist Party of Cambodia as well. So I would like to proceed to the next uh, question. Your Honor. Another interjection. Could we please be oriented in terms of time? Because from the statement I'm following, we seem to be well into 1978, 1979. So we're clearly, clearly getting away from the issues we're meant to discuss today. So perhaps the civil party could be asked when these things were happening. Thank President, thank you. Uh, as the chamber has advised the parties and members of the public that at this stage the trial chamber is not able to make a clear-cut decision as to the allocation of time for parties simply because uh, the knowledge of the civil parties as well as the uh, witnesses and experts varies depending on uh, the knowledge uh, they have. That's why in terms of the time allocations, we have given an indication. However, uh, we have notified, we have advised the party that uh, question be asked 
which is close uh, to the uh, segment of the trial. And the chamber has also advised the parties that they reserve the rights in the future hearings that they would we would endeavor uh, to allocate the times as appropriately and efficiently as possible. So I would uh, remind uh, parties to uh, refer to the memorandums on the uh, conduct of the proceeding in the first uh, segment of trial. This was not to mention my oral uh, clarification uh, in the uh, proceeding, and I hope that uh, parties uh, would uh, observe uh, the uh, flow of the proceedings as advised by the chamber. Appliquer la procédure telle qu'elle a été définie par la cour. Civil party lawyer. Thank you, Mr. Pro President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Who appointed you to be the Deputy Secretary of District 21? Qui vous a désigné Secretary of District 21? Uh, the uh, committee, the zone committee from Ban Long, ja, the defense is on his feet. Could the witness? Civil party lawyers, you may now proceed uh, with your questions. But uh, please avoid re re repetitious questions. Poursuivre, Maître Moxovanari, mais veuillez éviter de vous répéter dans vos questions. Secondly, uh, please confine your facts uh, to the first segment of trial as indicated by the defense team for Nguyen Chia that if the facts are relevant to the period uh, in 1978 or 79, it was out of the scope of our uh, hearing at this phase. So we now should confine our argument to the first phase the of evacuation from the city to the and the central uh, zone to the northern zone and eastern zone. Et de la zone centrale vers le nord et le, et l'est. So this first phase of uh, mass movement of people uh, concerns with the earlier period uh, of the control of the Khmer Rouge, uh, it is not related to uh, the time period from 1978 or 1979. So once again, I would like to remind you that uh, you should confine yourself uh, to the time uh, that is relevant uh, to the uh, first phase of the trial. And if you go beyond the scope of times that is confined to this first segment, uh, it's going to be out of the uh, scope of our uh, hearing in this, in this space. And secondly, uh, if the parties continue to object 
against uh, these questionings, then it's going to prolong the time of the hearing, and it is a waste of time uh, for uh, the uh, court as well. So once again, I would like to remind parties that questions should be uh, precise, succinct, and clear uh, to the uh, civil party, and it should be in order uh, in order of the uh, facts indicated in the closing order. Moitsovanari, thank you, Mr. Oui, President. May I ask for Liu to also make uh, some observation for Nous record? We take Seriously, in particular when it comes to the temporal period, we were about to touch upon this issue as well, and that uh, time and again we were challenged. So far as I remember, when we read uh, the memorandum concerning the severance, the first segment of the trials include as well the structure, administrative structure of the democratic Cambodia from the period bit, uh, before 1975 and from 1975 to the 6th of January 1979. So I am convinced that any question that is relevant to the administration, administrative structure of Khmer Rouge could somehow fall within the lim uh, that uh, period of time as uh, allocated. Uh, and these questions will be relevant to the administrative structure at the District 21 and the case supervision uh, back then. If you honor allow, we can proceed. The President, indeed, uh, you are allowed to proceed with your questions. We would just uh, like to remind other parties as well to be guided uh, by the facts that laid out in the or a proper order so that we can fully manage uh, these uh, proceedings smoothly and very well. Much wonder, thank you, Mr. Uh, thank you, President, and I believe that indeed uh, we are in the good hand of uh, your honors. Uh, my question to you again, Mr. Clangfit, uh, who appointed you as the Chief of District 21? Response. Response. Taya. Taya. Uh, five people altogether Cinq who were the total. members or the committees of the zone who appointed uh, me. Uh, Tatin was uh, the ta chief of all. Leur chef. Kampé was Kampé the deputy. So people who represented three districts uh, appointed me. Donc des gens qui so I was qui in ont charge désigné. of District 21. Et on m'a confié le District 21. While Boy and Pao um, were Pao in charge of other two districts. District 21 and 22. Question. Question. When was you appointed as deputy chief of the district 21? District 21. Response. Réponse. In 76. En 76. Question. Question. How was you appointed? Comment avez-vous été désigné? Response. Réponse. I was invited or called to the meeting and told that the country was now uh, an independent country. We had, uh, we, uh, people were needed to work to help build the country. Tin, who was from Tampun, ethnic minority group, also attended the same meeting. 
a participé aussi à cette réunion. When the chiefs uh, of the sectors were appointed, quand les chefs de secteur ont été désignés, then the chiefs and deputy chiefs of chefs district chefs uh, were de consequently été appointed. Désignés à leur tour. And uh, we were told that uh, we had to help on nous a dit que nous work uh, to build our countries and our communes et, uh, because the country was independent. Maintenant que le pays était devenu indépendant. When you worked as deputy chief of District 21, how many communes were you tasked uh, with uh, administering? 21. Combien de communes Response, votre responsabilité? six communes Réponse, all together. Six communes au total. Re question. question. Can you tell the court uh, the names of those communes and who were the cadres who were in charge of each commune? Qui étaient les cadres responsables de chacune de ces communes? Response. Indeed, I know the names of those communes because uh, each commune had a three, two to three people Chaque appointed to manage the communes. Question: Can you tell us in detail who actually managed those communes? Question: Pouvez-vous nous donner leur nom? Response: I Réponse. can remember all the names of those uh, people. Question: Can you then tell the court who they are? Pouvez-vous nous les donner? Response: In Réponse. Commune 21, Commune 21, there were more Mui, more Mui commune. La commune. But uh, now is Talao commune. Back then it was le nom de commune de Amwan commune or More Mui. More Mui ou Amwan. I was in charge of more Mui commune, responsable de la commune de Mormoui. and then more P, more Ensuite, more Bay, P, more Bun, more, Bay, more Pram, more, more Promui. I don't remember Pram, the other names other than Je I myself, who is really um, me souviens pas des autres, non, in charge of uh, more Mui. Et responsable de more Question, Mui. can you tell the court whether you remember the Question. people who actually in nous charge dire of si those communes? Question, can you tell the court whether you remember the people who actually in charge of those communes? Question, can you tell the court whether you remember the people who actually in charge of those communes? Three, all together for one Donc, commune. Trois personnes. Pour cette commune. Question: What about Question. more P? Qu'en est-il de more commune. P? Chun, Lun, Chun, Click, Lun, three people click. as well. Trois personnes. What about more by? Question. Question. Et more by. Respond. Yun. Réponse. Blaine. Yun. Turn. Blaine. Three people et turn. as well. Trois personnes. Question: What Question. about Qu'en est-il? More Boon commune. The more Boon. Uh, the interpreter could not really get the message since the mic was not on. L'interprète n'a pas compris car le micro était éteint. What about um uh, uh, more Pramui? Question: More Pramui. Time again, interpreter knows the mic plus, was not activated le micro pas and activé the message was cut. Et, uh, la cabine n'a pas entendu le message. The w civil party could be advised to get back to more boon, please. More boon. Please help us in this place. Please name the party. Ah, look, I'm not going to make home. No, get how? Do you make home or go? Get me into more absent. How you been? Did look, I'm. Get how? I make home. No, how make home? Just the morning, look, I'm. Ne. The president, civil party, Le président. you are now reminded again to begin responding when the mic uh, is activated, otherwise your activé. message would not be Sinon, conveyed uh, through interpreting. Les interprètes ne peuvent and vous entendre. Uh, 
interpreter who is next to the civil party could you help uh, press the button so that the, so that the mic is activated so that he can really see the light and start to respond or you may be of assistance to assist him for example to hold on until he sees the red light when responding to question. Le Interpreter has répondre. indicated to the chamber that uh, question should be sta uh, again started from um, uh, or more by since the message was cut uh, short uh, for the reason that the mic uh, was not activated and the interpreter could not render. Motsovanari. Thank you, Mr. President. I would like to Merci, proceed uh, from Moore Bay again. Could you tell us Bay. who was in charge of Moore Bay? Dire qui était responsable de cette commune? Response. Jung. Réponse. Jung. Peng Lan. Peng Lan. Peng Tan. Peng Three Tan. people. Three people. Question: Could you proceed Question. to M or Mo Boon? Puis who were they? Boon. Response: Réponse. Jing, Ping, Jing, Twin, Ping, et Twin. Three people. Three person. Question: Thank. Could you please go Question. to Mo Pram? Puis Mo Pram. Nine. Réponse. Lit. Learn. Response. Nit. I forget another person because le nom de la uh, he died. Il est mort. Question: Could you proceed to more Question. Pramway? Et more Pramway. Response: Réponse. I remember only two: Cheng and Hain. Hain. I don't remember the, the third Je person. Ne me souviens pas he died. Du nom de la as troisième well. personne, lui aussi est mort. Much Banri, thank you. Question. I would like to proceed to another question. As the deputy Je chief of question. District 21, what Comme kind of task were you asked to do? Nous les que Response. Vous I was in charge of Réponse. educating people, educating de them on how to do farming. De leur, uh, Montrer comment euh, sur les questions d'agriculture. Agri Question. Can you tell the court Question. in your capacity as the person in charge of educating people on farming, how did you do sur that? Sur les questions agricoles, pouvez-vous nous dire comment Response. vous l'avez fait? There were people who assisted Réponse. me with documents. Des there were clerks avec des and messengers Il y avait des because they could read des the, the documents. Eux I could not. Lire les documents alors que je ne pouvais le faire moi -même. Question. Question. For example, when orders were rendered from upper echelon and Quand you were asked to uh, implement the orders. How were the orders be implemented? Ces ordres en œuvre. Comment ces ordres été exécutés? As the deputy Réponse. chief of the district, uh, I had a lot of difficulties. Chef adjoint du district, In 1970, en 1976, when I was appointed as the deputy chief, people chef were adjoint. gathered and uh, to put in one place to do farming. And On people in villages had to be relocated, uh, and we had to look for land ready for farming, and so that cultivées. the land can accommodate uh, the people who would be relocated. Um, A lot of people would be evacuated to in 
plusieurs personnes, village, because the land was huge uh, there. I was uh, having a lot of difficulty as a deputy chief. I sometimes would adjoint. wish to commit suicide by hanging myself, but uh, I, because uh, I was uh, shouldering lots of tasks. Uh, I didn't like the idea that people be relocated. And as a deputy chief of the district, I didn't feel that district, there would be a need to relocate people. But I was intimidated. Gens, I was threatened. Otherwise, uh, we would uh, be killed. So we Sinon, had to really tué. obey the orders. We had to build them. We had to really make the most of the land, leave no piece of land uh, unused. De cultiver le the plus President, de terre possible. Uh, thank you, le Mr. Clanfit. Uh, since Merci it is Monsieur now Clanfit. appropriate time to take an le adjournment, the court will take the adjournment for 20 minutes. The session will resume again at 3 o'clock.